I got right back on here real quick. I'm going to do a Jack in the Box book bang. I haven't ate there in a while, so I figured I'd eat here because I got I had to go to another town where there is a Jack in the Box so I could go grocery shopping in a Kroger. So, I got Jack in the Box. Got a big fat bag there. And I got an unsweet tea. It's not the best tea in the world because it's Gold Peak, which I don't know. Like. But it'll be okay because I got to drink it anyways because I got to have something to drink while I'm eating and I don't drink that. I don't know. So. I got some sauces. Sweet and sour sauce. And soy sauce. I thought they had stopped curing soy sauce, but it looks like they brought it back. Mm. They like gave me all the sauces, people. They gave me like, they really gave me a handful of soys and I only asked for one, but okay. I got their nuggets to try. I've never had their chicken nuggets. More sweet and sour sauce. Dang, they let me. I got egg rolls. I got egg rolls because you know I like their egg rolls. And you know I always have the apps and I always tell you about using them and getting a deal. I got a Sardo Jack from my freebie off the app with my points. Now I think I had to pay the difference because I had to grow the onions and switched out the cheese. But for I think it was 50 and 50 or so for a dollar, I got a Sardo Jack. If that's the case. And then in the baggie, I got my tassels. You know how much I love my tacos. I got four crispy tacos. Four tacos. That back in the bag. That bag in the bag. Because I've had those. And I've had these. I'm going to give them nuggets a try. Because those are new to me. I've never had. I don't know. I may have had Jungle Box nuggets before. It's probably been a long time since I have. I have. Mmm, it's a sweet and sour sauce to get my nuggets in. I love sweet and sour sauce. Let's try about it, then I go without any sauce. Mmm. Mmm. These are good. It kind of remind me of Wendy's nuggets. I mean, Wendy's and Burger King because they're kind of strong. Mmm. Mmm. I'll share that sweet and sour sauce. Mmm. That is the bomb, man. Mmm, got the nuggets and got some sweet and sour. Mmm. 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 No, no, I didn't count. This is better for me. Okay. Well, I'm gonna try something. That was really good. I'm gonna be weird and try something. I'm gonna dip my taco in sweet and sour sauce and see if it's any good. We all know I like their tacos. Mmm. It's not bad except the meat's on in the middle. I don't want to eat it. Mmm. I'm just dipping the shell in there. It wasn't bad. Mmm, I'm missing meat right here, so I'm gonna see if it's good. Mmm, I'm really just on the show. Mmm. Mmm. It's weird, but it's good. It works surprisingly. Mmm. Mmm. Now that was fun. I'm going to try sauce to work on this taco. Probably not. That probably not taste so good. But you know what? I'm going to try it anyways. I'm one of those people that like to try weird combinations of things sometimes. Like last night I made dinner for me and my husband. 
and it it, it it did it sucked I don't know what I did wrong but it just didn't at first I didn't get the noodles cooked enough and I've had to pressure cook it but I didn't have enough liquid so then it liquidified all the liquid out mm. Mmm. Mmm. And the lettuce part is not bad. Because it's kind of like a chicken lettuce wrap. Mmm. I put too much, but. It's not bad, but it doesn't really work work. Mmm. I would say, if you're going to dip it in anything, maybe the ranch. Or their sweet and sour sauce, okay. I just don't dip it in anything. At all. We don't have to dip it. You know, it's your choice. Mmm. Mmm. That gives it more zip and zing. I think it's almost spicier with the sweet and sour, but sweet and sour can be a little, yeah, strong. Mmm. Mmm. Can't go down about second taco. It's just that con. If they ever took these off the menu, I don't know, they wouldn't be in there anymore. Oh, I can't say anybody, but a lot of people wouldn't be in there anymore because they'd be so, it's like when Taco Bell got rid of the Mexican meat, I quit in there for a while because they did. I just quit in there because I was getting tired of talking about too. Well, they brought it back, and then now I've eaten there, but I don't get it very often. But I like the potato taco, so you know. And we usually get the cravings box, and you get everything included for the price. And I'm like six bucks or something. And I paid ten dollars a Jack and Box over today, and I got a lot of things for ten dollars. I know how to shop smart. I was sourdough jack for free because of my points. So I had to pay for that. I paid for my tacos. They're 99 cents for two on the app. A lot cheaper. Kelsey, you need to get the maps, girl. Save yourself some money. I'm going to be like, I can afford it. I can afford it. And people are like, what you order? I get. But you could film an order off of a different phone. But, yeah. And then show the filming of it. Of ordering it, I guess. Right, peep, like I do. I just repeat back what I got. Mmm. Mmm. I don't know what won't work. The soy sauce and like. Mm -mm. I'm not entirely that won't be good. Mm mm. That one not taste good. Mmm. This is good. It's not quite as spicy as sometimes. It's good. And I don't get taco sauce because I don't like chocolate. I don't think it's even spicy. Mmm. And then so I'm eating all this at like. Mm, Oh, but we're 9 o'clock in the morning. This is my breakfast. Slash lunch. Later breakfast or lunch. Mm. Yeah, I was starving because I didn't get... I shouldn't say starving. I was really hungry because I didn't get much dinner. Because dinner didn't work out the way I wanted it to. And I didn't like it. So, I just didn't eat much. I just turned me off from eating. After I ate... How many hard noodles the first time? I was like, no, I can't do this. Mm. And then my cousin, my cousin was my husband, finished cooking it, and it turned out good. We added more liquid. Because my ninja fish is like, add liquid, add water, add water, add water, add a water. Okay. So we added some water. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. Tea makes me burp.
Mmm. Thank you, my man. My name is a barbecue salad. Mmm. That was so good. I don't sweet and sour from here. My name is the barbecue sweet and sour salad. If you look at it, it's similar in color. Mm. Now, since sour is sweet and sour, but it depends on where you get it from and what it tastes like. Some zippier and zingier than others. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right, let's go for this one. I'm trying to see if I had some of my sour back. I customized it is because I do not like ketchup. Nope. Don't give me ketchup on my burger. Won't take it. I'm not a big huge fan of Swiss cheese. So I switched out the cheese and then I added garlic onions. And I took out the tomatoes. But I still got the butter, sourdough jack, and it's still got the mayonnaise. I just take the ketchup off and then I switched the cheese. That looks good. That bacon looks pretty crispy. Look at them grilled onions on there. I'm oh, sorry, I don't think you can see that. Mmm. Mmm. That is a good grilled onion. Oh, it's so good. And this didn't, it took a little bit because it was breakfast time and I ordered all lunch food pretty much. But it didn't take that long actually because a lot of it's just throw in the fry and go. You know, jack in the box with the nuggets, doom. Fry made up, fry them. Doom, taco, same thing. You know, this, this is fresh-ish. Fresh, so. Anyways, the egg roll is frozen, deep fried. Mmm. Mmm. That is some crispy bacon. Oh, God, it's so crispy. It's falling out. It's thin and crispy. Oh. Mm-mm. I think that's a pre-cooked bacon. Mmm. Oh, I may be wrong, but I think it's that, like, Oscar Mayer or Hormel pre-cooked and then just crisped it up more. Probably, really, truthfully, is. I could be wrong. I don't think it is. Well, no, it's past your problem. I don't know, they're frying eggs back up there. They're making eggs fresh back there. I see him cracking the egg and everything. It's not out of a car. It's a cracked egg. Mmm. Mmm. No taste right. Yellow cheese. Mmm. Mmm. This is good. I love a sourdough jack. I don't eat sourdough bread much. I'm not a huge fan of sourdough bread too often. But a sourdough jack? I don't like that. Mm. Mm. This and the tacos and the apple. And maybe they're gonna fry it. I'm my most favorite, but you know, well, it's not my a lot. That's it, sourdough jack and the tacos. Now I missed the bacon cheese potato wedges. I took those off the menu. I just eat those all the time, dude. And the bacon and cheese on potato wedges. Oh my god, they were so good. But I think they took them off because none of the people were them anymore. I'm, I'm guessing. And yes, I've tried the tiny tacos. And no, I do not like them. They are different. They're not the same. Mm Epicons. 
Sorry, guys, I'm about to blow my nose. Let me go for a second. Just deal with it. It's allergy season around here. What can I say? Sorry, guys. You had to see that. Sonic came through when I went to Sonic. They gave me napkins. Where are you at, Jack from the box? Where are you at? Man, this video is already 15 minutes long, guys, and I haven't even done much. Well, I'm gonna get into my egg roll. I need that on camera so I can show y'all my egg roll. And then I'll probably just end the video after this. Gotta have that sweet and sour sauce. If I can get it in there. Mmm. 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 I just put that with soy in it. I haven't had one of these in so long with soy sauce in it. Mmm. I don't know. I think I should put it in the jar. A little better, but I could mix the two. Mmm, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna mix the sweet and sour with the soy. Mmm, it's gonna be busting, people. Mmm. Excuse my finger. I got to sweat it out. Now let's try this. Mmm. Good, but uh, it's sweet and then you can taste it with the diamond. Mmm. 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 If that idea did not work out, don't do that. Mm, I don't mix too well. Mm. Mm. Anyways. So yeah. What's been going on with you? Leave it down in the comments if you want. Also, what's your favorite thing with Jack in the Box? Or maybe another fast food restaurant you like. Uh, problem is, I don't have a lot near me unless I go to these bigger towns. But you could suggest some, but I probably may not have them because of where I'm at. I'm out country more, so... You know, may, I may or may not have it. Like, cookout sounds good to try, but I don't got it. There's some other ones that sound like Bojangles. They sound really good to try. Don't have it either. I mean, you know, some of these ones I've seen other people do. I'm like, don't got that. Don't got that. You know, so. I have all the usual suspects, but. Like the McDonald's, Taco Bell, Jack, <laughs> Subway. You know, normal stuff like that. I don't have too many offshoots of different things. Well, I do have a burger joint that's kind of considered fast food because it's in, you can eat inside and they give you a buzzer. Or you can go through the drive-thru and pick it up. It's called Juicy's Hamburgers. I don't know if you've ever heard of it. It's not bad. I have to go to, I have to, go to one of the bigger town, Tyler, for that. Don't. 
you know, it's not bad. Their beans are really good. They get with it. For free. And we also have Juicy's Tacos. I'm not a huge fan. Now there is... Is it Taco Casa? Yeah. I will have to do a mukbang from there sometime. At Mount Pleasant. It's in Mount Vernon. But it's it's good. And it's cheap too for the brass. And they glob, you get the tostada, they glob the cheese on there and it's like a mound of cheese for the price. And it's like three something for the tostada. It is very reasonably priced place. What you get? Have a good day. God bless.